All right, watching the CEL, which, by the way, I don't know if you've noticed, but we rolled over to the June contract. So watching the uh, ES and the CEL better because of the push and the uh, stronger potential for exhaustion. So at the open of the next bar, I'm going to be looking for a rock star. And if we get one, it will be a gold one, so that'll qualify it for a rock star setup or at least a naked rock star setup we got our speed tick we got our ricochet we're overbought and we have our pullback alert so good potential here if we get a rock star oh now we have climactic volume and we got a rock star and i shorted it And plus five. So we watch this. We've just got this steady climb here, steady building momentum. And look at the size of these bars. And all of a sudden, we had this bar. This is an upthrust bar. The momentum traders generated this upthrust bar. We got a um, speed tick, which is what kind of gets us looking at this. Um, because every trade we take except one is preceded by a speed tick. So that gets us at least, you know, our, gets our uh, head on a swivel. This bar is overbought. That's this pink outline. We had the type of volume inside this bar that we're looking for to identify the churning, meaning that the buyers were well in control here. The seller started jumping out and that way we can expect this drop here so all of this confluence here suggested this little pullback right here now this is our strength right here this is our edge what happens after this no clue don't know if it's going to keep dropping don't know if it's going to go up this helps us anticipate what's going to happen right now and for us, that's a hard target plus five in and out. 